asking for a decision. Now, this is a tough topic because nothing in your business happens until a decision is made. You can't be afraid to ask people to make a decision. It's how they make positive steps with you as their coach. And it's also how you'll be able to better manage your time by focusing it, focusing it on those who are ready to start instead of those who are not. So as a coach, there are some reasons why you don't ask for a decision from your contacts. The number one reason is fear of rejection. What if they say no? Fear of success. Will they really be successful? Self doubt. I don't want to let them down. Lack of follow-up. I said I would get to back to them last week, but I didn't. And five, a desire to be busy. If I keep them in my potential customer's pool, I feel like I have stuff to do. So regardless of the reason not asking for a decision from your potential customers or coaches creates a negative momentum for your business. And don't worry about sounding pushy. If you are sincere and you show your interest, which is to help people or that person, it won't come off as salesy or pushy. You're trying to help them and encourage them to take the steps to help themselves. So here's some suggestions on how you can better ask for decisions. Be bold. Don't beat around the bush. Show how confident you are by clearly asking for a decision. Make it easy for them to decide. Express confidence in them and their ability to see the results. Give them options, but suggest a solution. People like options, but always give a recommendation. Like, here's two programs I think you would enjoy. Check out their videos. Let me know what you think. Have them come back to you. Let them tell, tell, have them tell you what they think that they would like to do. And then you can tell them, well, I think that's a great option because you have problems with nutrition, that kind of thing. Follow up, but don't chase. Give a follow-up date. Don't just drop in out of the blue. Keep yourself focused on why it will be good for them. When they feel your interest is to sincerely help them, their willingness to make a positive decision increases. So just be bold. Get out there and ask. And follow up and just say, listen, you are doing yourself a disservice not doing this program. You have so much potential. Just be positive, be direct, be clear, and, you know, don't be afraid.